Hello, my beautiful beauties and my wonderful lovelies. A pleasant morning to everyone. Now, I did a previous video that spoke about my heart having compassion for some prostitutes that I came across on Haining Road. And I know they're at different points across our island. You know, I'm in the Kingston area, so you know you have the different sections. You know, Ripon Road, Haining Road, I'm, I'm told Crossroads, Halfway Tree, different areas. And my beautiful people, for those who are Christians, and even if you're not you know, as a humanitarian, I hope that when you see these young women, don't scoff at them, you know, encourage them. Stop. I mean, you have to use wisdom and be guided by the Holy Spirit. You know, hopefully somebody else is with you that you can speak to them. They're human beings. And I guarantee if you hear most of their stories, some of them are tragic or most of them are tragic. And tragic doesn't mean only, you know, it has to be a physical situation that propels them and pushes them into such lifestyle. But their lives have been difficult. It has been not easy. Unfortunately, do have parents who send them out to do these things to earn. You know, the Bible says the love of money is a root, not the root, but it is a root of all kinds of evil. And the reason why it has to be a root and not the root, you do have people who are led to do evil things that are not money driven. The late and great and venerable Dr. Maz Monroe spoke about a man who came upon, came upon a lady, startled her with a gun. And um, she said, I can give you money. I can give you everything that you need. Please don't kill me. He said, lady, I really don't need any money. I just killed two persons. It felt good to me. And I want to kill a third. So you have people who take enjoyment and uh, there is pride in killing other people. So my beautiful people, I ask that, you know, we we have a little, you know, mercy where other people are concerned and we don't um, judge them, but we find ways of helping them, telling them, telling them that there is a better way out, telling them that, look here, you don't need to sell your body to earn. I know it is not easy. I can't pay your bill. Probably I can't. I can probably only give you some money for now, you know, but on a long term basis. There is a God who, who sits and looks low and he can take care of your needs, your wants. He will grant you your needs, all of your needs, some of your wants he will grant. So there is a better way. Christians, you need to go out and minister to these people. We need to stop the judging now. We need to stop the gossiping, the hating, the being unforgiving. We need to cut out these things and know that there is work to do. That could be your daughter. Or your son for those who the men who do it. Follow me on TikTok, subscribe to my YouTube channel, share this so it can help others.